it's been a minute, and I really miss making these videos for you guys. With Chief Training Camp starting this week, I will have plenty of videos and community posts for you guys going forward. I'm super excited about this season, and I can't wait to see how this team will improve from last year. I came across this clip earlier of Dan Orlovsky spitting facts. I agree with him and Lewis Riddick 100%. Dan stated that if Xavier Worthy and Hollywood Brown are what people are expecting them to be with the Chiefs offense, you can write the Chiefs down for a three-peat. I mean, if you look at the team as a whole, I really think this is one of the more complete teams in the NFL. The Chiefs really didn't lose much this offseason. They still have the best head coach in the NFL, the best defensive coordinator in the NFL, the best quarterback in the NFL, a top three O-line, and a vastly improved receiver core, which I honestly think this could be the most skilled receiver core Patrick Mahomes has had while in Kansas City. On defense, I think the Chiefs are solid all around, and despite the loss of LeJarrius Sneed, this secondary is still much better than people are giving the Chiefs credit for. I expect this defensive unit to be top five with all of the experience and chemistry that those guys have returning. Check out the video. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. Hit that like for the algorithm. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. They do that. We know this. It's not a matter of whether they have the talent to win the three, win it again. It's a matter of whether they can bring that any given Sunday mentality once again and do something that Dan has literally never been done before. Yeah, I mean, if Hollywood Brown and Xavier Worthy are what they're expected to be, you can write the three peat down. Wow. Already. This offense, the offensive line Lewis mentioned is going to be really good. Yep. This offense was capable enough last year without any vertical speed, really. Yep. The defense kept them in games. Yeah. That defense is in many ways still intact. I know it's Legereus is not there, and yeah. all due respect, phenomenal cover corner. But the meat of this defense is still there. Yeah. So if the defense is still there, was on the backs of a Super Bowl win, if those two guys bring back the explosive element to this offense and the speed element to this offense, you can mark down the three piece. Hey, Lewis, real quick, do you agree with that, especially losing Snead? Yeah, look, David Merritt, their defensive back coach, him and Steve Spagnuolo is the best combination maybe in, in, in football right now. You just don't hear David Merritt's name. And remember the work that Brett Feach did in the 22 draft, all the DBs that he drafted. That sure. set, they mm. won the Super Bowl against Philadelphia with basically a bunch of rookies in the secondary. Got All it. those guys are third-year players now, and they've won two Super Bowls. They'll be fine. Okay.